So by default, you're working in a certain color space which supports a range of colors for your project. But if you want more dynamic colors to be supported um, and you want to uh, export with such color spaces, then you can go around onto the modify section right here when the project is opened. And over here, you can see that color space is an option right here. By default, you can see that SDR is an option right here, which is the standard uh, range of colors used in a project. But if you want more of the color spaces, then you can choose high dynamic um, uh, SDR color range over here as well and press save right here. So it says the device does not support um, uh, color space right here. So you do need a supporting monitor as well as you can see right here. But if you do have it, then you can go around and change out, uh, change it out to high dynamic range right here. So you do need a monitor and hardware that supports as, uh, uh, supports it as well. But if you do, then you can um, go around and change it out to that particular color space and get more dynamic and vibrant colors um, uh, as an output as well. So that is how you can access and change the color space settings as you want inside of CapCut Desktop Editor. So hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe. <laughs>